Good morning, happy Monday. I don't know what's happening with my hair, but it keeps trying to go middle part, which I'm just, it doesn't look right. Um, you got your ball? We got her this cute little pink Nike basketball when we went to the Nike outlets this last weekend. Um, we get Ethan back today, which is so great. Every Monday, every other Monday, we get him back. So he will be here a little bit later this morning after we get back from the gym. Um, and I'm so excited because I missed him. We got him some new clothes for school to start because at least here, um, school's starting back up. Um, we're in Northern California and so our COVID cases are very, very low. I think we're at like, oh gosh, look at this. <laughs> look what's happening with mom's hair. Um, we're at like 215 cases or something per 180,000 population. Um, and that's 200 and something cases since March. So, and we have one or two hospitalizations. So our numbers thankfully are very low. So schools are opening because we're not on California's watch list. That's why our gyms and stuff are still open. Um, but all restaurants are closed throughout the state of California. Oh, here I get lipstick on my face. Uh. <laughs> It's so funny because she's never this um, cuddly, but because we left her for one day, like all she wants is to be constantly held. But you know what? I don't mind. I missed you. Mm. Did you miss mama and dada when we were gone? Mm. Went to Reno for a little anniversary trip, which was really nice. It was only one night, but we definitely needed a little getaway. So um, brother's coming back today. We don't really have any plans. I did get him some new school clothes, so I might show you guys those. Old well, Navy was having a good sale, and then I had um, a bunch of Kohl's, or not Kohl's cash, uh, Old Navy cash. I got her some new Old Navy stuff too. Mm. This little dress was like, I don't know, $10. And then I got her little jelly shoes. We got Finn chasing light reflections over here. There he goes. Um, this was clearance at um, Lululemon. I got makeup on it when I put it on. But it was like $29 from Lululemon. And then these are, Gymshark. It's their um, adapt seamless line. So we're gonna head off to the gym. So it's Monday, so Ted is home today. And I made us both pizzas. Ethan just brought his up to Ted's office. I'm editing the vlog from last week. Um, and then I'm also working on filling out the description box for the empties video. And then for Ethan, I have some rice. He's on his second bowl of this. This I made yesterday. You can make it in the crock pot. That's how I make it. It's just chicken, salsa, uh, kidney beans, black beans, and corn. And you just slow cook it. Super easy. So that's what he's going to have. It's one of his favorites. And that is our lunch today. Liv is uh, not eating really anything. Ethan, you want to show your new outfit? Wait, I need to tell you something. Okay. Um, on Fortnite, they made the Renegade emo. Oh, wow. Renegade. How do you do it? Renegade, Renegade. Show me. Whenever I see it, I don't know how to do it. This is how I think. Okay. This is how I do it. Yeah. Oh. Did you get those dance moves from your dad? No, I just randomly do weird dance moves and then hit the whoa. Oh, show me. How do you hit the whoa? Oh, that's like the old school whoa, though. People don't hit the whoa like that anymore. How did they do that? No, that's like windshield wiper whoa. <laughs> We're going to have to update you on the new whoa. Hi. Good morning. Happy Tuesday. I thought I'd show you my outfit here. Hold on. Olivia, come here. We're not going to go up the stairs right now. Come here, baby. Come here. Oh, no, 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 no. Come on. Come on, let's go downstairs. Come on. Come on. Isn't her outfit so cute? TJ Maxx, it's the Jessica Simpson line. Come on, yeah, how do you get down? Can you show me? Okay, come on, let's go down the stairs. Come on, let's go down the stairs. Can I help you? Okay, go on here. Okay, let's try that again, <laughs> outfit of the day. This is from Gap. I have this in like a hot coral too, which is so pretty. And so this is the black one. It has like a little knotted tie. I know that the tops are still in stock, but the shorts sold out so fast after I posted 
the coral ones. I think you guys bought them all out on Instagram. So um, this is the black, they're kind of ribbed and they're so cute. So I also got the rust colored top. And then my shoes, I've just had these for ever, like years and years and years. And so I'm gonna go to the gym. I don't know what we're gonna do. And these two are gonna go to childcare. You wrestling with Finn? Are you forgiving him? Finn stepped in Ethan's no-no. What's it called? Your no-no square? Yeah. Finn, you can't do that. You can't step in anyone's no-no square. You figured it out? No, you don't lick it. Uh. So we got Finn his first bark box. Oh, 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 Finn. Oh, 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 Finn. Finny, you're getting your first box. We figured since Liv gets love every, and Ethan was getting, he got Bits box for a while, but we didn't love it. And then he got, what, Kiwi box? We did that for quite a while. Oh, Finn, you almost took me out. You got your first bark box. <gasps> oh, Finn, what do you think? Look, buddy. Look right here. Look. <laughs> Finn. No, 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 Finn. Finn. <laughs> look, look. Oh, Scoobs. Oh, my goodness. <gasps> you got Scooby snacks. What else did you get? Um, you got Scooby. <laughs> oh, and you got the van. What else? What's that? Oh, my goodness. Did he get like a cool, what is this? <gasps> oh, it's a Scoob snack sandwich. <laughs> and then what's in here? Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Baby. Chicken and turkey and then a salmon dog treat. Oh my so a little Scooby box. This is not sponsored by the way. I just bought like six months or a year. What do you think, Finny boy? Your toys. <laughs> Are you reading it? Can you read that to me? Do you like your toys, buddy? Do you like your toys? You're always still brothers and sissies. Now you have your own. Yeah. <laughs> so last vlog i was talking about buying her some like big legos these are the ones i got and i just got them at target um but they had like um, ones that had more pink and purple in it oh look at it, i found a binky in there <laughs> and then they had ones that were more like primary colors um but i like the pinky purple pastels with the chartreuse because you know it's like my jam it's my color right now um so anyways oh it matches your dress Liv. She's been loving playing with these, and Ethan likes playing with them. When I uh, go to the gym, they have some of these blocks, and she's always been excited to play with them. That's why I got them, and then she started trying to play with Ethan's Legos, but they're just too small, and I just get too nervous about her, like, trying to put them in her mouth, even though she's been really good about not doing that, um, but she seems to really like these, and so I think they work just perfectly fine for her, huh? She loves to just destroy anything that you create. What do you think? This one is, look at Livy. This one's pink and this one is blue. Pink and blue. <laughs> What's so funny is he always takes the kids' stuffed animals like all the time and just carries them around. 
He doesn't really chew them too often. Sometimes he'll chew the eyeballs off of them, but he doesn't tend to chew them, but he'll still stuff the animals constantly. But now that he has his own, he's choosing not to steal them. But did you throw the ball for Finny? That was so nice. And we still have not put photos in those frames. <laughs> someday, someday I'll get around to it. But I got those at Michael's. And then since our Home Goods has opened, I got a few things um, from Home Goods. These uh, are from Restoration Hardware. This is like a buffet table or buffet cabinet. And then these are technically, I guess they call them bathroom shelves. But here's a few little things I got from Home Goods. It's clearly not fully decorated. I also got these books at Home Goods too. There's a, they had a YSL book. And then this one, I just love the coffee table books. These are all my restoration um, magazines. This I've had for a really long time. So I still have to decorate. It's not even close to being done. And then these were also from rest, uh, not restoration hardware, from Home Goods. The Chanel book is from Home Goods. Both of those are from Home Goods. So are the vases. So I need ideas of what to put up here. Should I do like a plant? I don't know. Just doesn't look finished. I know that the shelves still need to be decorated, but the top needs to be decorated too. And I just don't know what to put there. Livy, does Bubba have you? Oh, that's so fun. Wee! You having fun too, Finny boy, huh? Brother's diving for rings, where'd he go? There he is. Oh, you want me to throw the ring? Okay, hold on. Ready? Here's the ring, ready? <laughs> so graceful. Liv wasn't feeling the pool today, huh? No pool time, didn't really want to swim. She just wanted to walk around with her popsicle. Finn's over here losing his mind because he wants to swim, but he just got over having an ear infection. And so I don't really want him in the pool too much, but I thought it'd be a nice little treat because he hasn't swam for like three or four weeks. So he got to swim and now that's all he wants to do. And Ethan's in there just swimming away like a little fish. I'm also eating a popsicle. They're like 15 calories and they're so good. They're just like the sugar-free popsicle brand popsicles, the tropical ones. They're so good. You got your sunscreen? Well, that one's mom's, but. So you were just supposed to pick out one book. You were supposed to find one book for us to read. And we seem to have pretty much pulled them all down. Found all the books. Happy Wednesday morning. We're getting ready to go to the gym. We get some breakfast, huh? We both have crazy hair today. <laughs> I got to your hair. Isn't her dress so cute? This is um, Jessica Simpson from TJ Maxx brand. It's so cute. So we're gonna get some breakfast and get going to the gym. Ethan's still trying to wake up. Okay, so I mentioned in the last vlog, it's really hard to get her to eat like any type of meat. And so um, it's hard to get protein for her. So I've been feeding her these um, Greek yogurts and there's 13 grams of protein. So it's really good when she actually will eat a full one. She gets a decent amount of protein for the day. Because otherwise it is really hard to get her to eat anything that's like high in protein. Huh. You got some berries. But you like to yogurt. So that's good, isn't it? It's a good start, isn't it? Mm. Mm. We're kind of in a hurry this morning. Otherwise, I'd probably let her feed herself. But this morning, I'm feeding her. <laughs> Good job. All right, thought I'd show you guys my little outfit of the day today to go to the gym. My pants are Gymshark. And, they and they're the Adapt. Me. I do match. Adapt leggings. This top is from Bal Balance Athletica. I don't think they have it available in this color anymore, but maybe this style. And then my shoes are just white Adidas shoes, Ethan. 
his outfit. Top is from Old Navy. He dressed himself today. And then show me your pants. Pants, Old Navy. Shoes, you got your first pair of what are they? Nike. Nike Air Jordans. Very cool. Look at We got these at the outlets, but I love those. They were super cool. And Liv, show me your dress. Can you show me your dress? She's a flower. Wow, show me. So beautiful. And then her little shoes. Where'd your other one go? You gotta get your other shoe so we can go to the gym. <laughs> she loves her Bubba, huh? Hi, buddy. Um, I am doing, I think this is a small in the top. I wish I would've got an extra small because uh, it is pretty big. Um, and then the leggings are extra small. But um, these are still available with the shirt. I'm not too sure. So I'll link what I can. I have a wild lion mane today. I tried crimping it and then I slept on it weird. So anyways, we're going to go do... Don't they smell good? Oh, yeah. All right. What's wrong? Should we get your shoes on and go bye-bye? Come on, let's go get your shoes on. Bye-bye. No, 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 we're not going in the playroom. Come on. Oh my gosh. I'm so tired and so sweaty. One, I had a great leg day. Do you see this little cutie back here? I had a great leg day, um, but our new bed's getting delivered today. So we have a sleep number that I needed to move out of our room. And Ted's gone. <laughs> so um, luckily my father-in-law was able to come over for like 45 minutes to help me try to take the bed apart and move it into Ted's office for now. That was a lot harder than I expected. Oh my gosh. It's so stinking heavy and I'm not supposed to be like living, lifting anything heavy because of my surgery. Um, but, oh my goodness. All right, our new bed finally got here. Oh my goodness. I still have to finish cleaning the room, but so pretty i'm so excited i wonder how many times i'm gonna hit my shins on this thing uh it's a lot lower than i'm used to you can see there's quite a bit of wall space up there um but it's so pretty so i'm really excited i uh was trying to take a nice picture and had to hide ted's water bottles over there um what was i gonna say oh what we want to do is put big tall mirrors like these really cool mirrors behind each one and then obviously like decorate down there with not a box of tissue um so i'm excited to get this room finished and then i need to figure out what to do on this wall because right now i just have like this little ladder thing that has my like skims robes <laughs> but i don't know if we want to do like a picture wall if we want to put a mirror i don't know what we want to do there yet hi sis you getting ready for bed oh you got a mask look at you so still trying to figure out what we're gonna do on this wall though. Um, yeah, I still don't know. But the bed is from Restoration Hardware. The um, little nightstands are Restoration Hardware. The stag head is Restoration Hardware. Um, the mattress is Lowell mattress and same with the duvet cover. And then the pillows are all Target. How you doing? It's a lot easier for you to climb up, huh? You're getting stuck on this blankie. There you go. Oh, now Livy can crawl up here though. And then don't mind this, this is from our trip and I gotta finish doing laundry. But this is also restoration hardware. That is from Hobby Lobby. Um, but I wanna show you guys how I fold. These are all my, well, some of my workout pants. But I have all my workout pants color coordinated. I clearly have too many because they don't all fit. And then these are sports bras and again, color coordinated. And then these are all my workout shorts. So anyways, at least some part of my life is semi-organized. <laughs> oh gosh, but those are my workout stuff. Anyways, the room still has a lot of decorating. There's just like cluttery stuff everywhere right now. Just laundry, got done doing laundry, have to put it away. Returns to Old Navy. Um, Finn brought in Liv's lotion. I don't even know how he carried that in here. Old nursing bras that I got to put away. These things are going to go away. <laughs> He's a good boy. Yes, you are. Good boy. And then Liv always is carrying random stuff in here too. And my, ouch, why are you jumping on me? My makeup room is right there, which the door is closed because 
Lib and Finn go in there and bring in random objects. So, anyhow, I thought I'd show you guys the bed because I've been talking about it for so long. It's finally here. Why are you jumping on me? Why? Happy Thursday. I'm just getting ready for the day. I've got a lot of things I have to do today. I'm going to the gym like I always do. First thing in the morning at 8. Then, oh my gosh, I'm so tired. Um, I gotta get this room cleaned up because I have, you guys know, I got my rhinoplasty done back in February and I've been working with the aesthetic center. Well, we did like a video before my rhinoplasty, just kind of talking about why I was getting it done and all of that. And then we were supposed to film a like after video, <clears throat> like uh, after I got it all done, but COVID happened. So we had to cancel and reschedule it like three different times. So it's finally happening tomorrow. So they're going to come here and film. And so I got to get this room cleaned up and ready to go. And then our new bed came in yesterday. I already showed you that. It's interesting because it's very low to the ground. So it feels so strange sleeping that low to the ground. But Ted was really into the bed, which surprised me because he's like... Um, Ted really wanted the bed, which surprised me because it's like very, very low to the ground and he's like 6'2", six, 6'3". Six, so I'm like, okay, it's pretty low to the ground. But um, I mean, the mattress, we've been sleeping on that little mattress now for a little over a week and it's super comfortable. So um, the bed frame is pretty cool. I'm just trying to finish up this ColourPop BFF liner. I like it, but I definitely like the... Uh, wet and wild one better that I've been talking about. Um, my eyes, I'm just wearing the Going Coconuts palette. Pretty much just this, uh, actually, I'm wearing this color in my crease. And then, um, a lot of this one, this is the nude mood. I have this in my uh, upper, under my brow bone, this in my crease, these in my crease. That color is what's on my lid, so. I've just been literally using these same two palettes every day and then occasionally I'll do this color on my lid or I'll use this one which I showed in the last vlog, San Tropez by MAC. Um, today I'm trying out a new foundation though. It's this um, Herborean BB Cream. I've heard a lot of people talk about it. It's the 5-in-1 Baby Skin. I really like it. I think it's super pretty on the skin. I have the shade number 4, uh, D-O-R-E Dore, I think is how you say it. Um, and I'm pretty sure it's shade 4. I don't see it on the box anymore, but um, I think it's really pretty. Definitely more of like a light, it's more coverage than light coverage. See, I can't do my liner and talk at the same time. More coverage than light coverage, like a light medium, because um, it did cover pretty darn good. And the color is really nice too. This highlight is insane. Uh, it's this Revolution palette. I've had this for a long time. I used to talk about it all the time, and I have those two shades on my cheeks and then warm sole is what's uh, what blush I have on. So I'm gonna do my liner and stuff. And I'm gonna work out and then I gotta get this room cleaned up. This is Liv and this is her outfit of the day. Her super cute shirt from Amazon. Looks just like the Supreme shirt. Little black uh, biker shorts from Target and then her little Nikes from the Nike outlet. Look at, let me see. <laughs> All right, brother, what you wearing? Your Nike Air Jordans. Where's your pants from? Where's your shirt from? Old Navy. Old Navy. Love the tie-dye. Is it on backwards? Da -da. Are you sure? Uh -huh. Do you want me to check? <laughs> Let me see. Yeah, it's not on backwards. Good job. <laughs> Finn just wearing his normal ensemble. What you got going on there, Liv? Our new cabinet came in yesterday. This is from Restoration Hardware. We still have to figure it out, so we had to push the couch up quite a bit, which made this all kind of crammed. So we're gonna have to reconfigure this, but isn't that so pretty? Um, Restoration Hardware, Hobby Lobby, our house, or our house, A-R-H-A-U-S. Restoration Hardware, our house, that's not gonna stay. Hobby Lobby, Restoration Hardware, Nugget. It's the greatest little couch ever. Um, anywho, I'm pretty sure I probably already wore this in a different 
oh, workout outfit of the day. You guys, I'm just into the highlighter yellow and like chartreuse color. And then like the bright reddish orange. Um, this is from Old Navy, like, I don't know, $15. <clears throat> Pants are Gymshark. They are the Adapt. You can see they have the cool design. And then these shoes I got, oh, a little over a year ago. And they're Nikes, so. Um, and they're like that bright highlighter color. So anywho, that's the outfit of the day. We're gonna go work out. I gotta clean up my makeup room for filming tomorrow. I'm gonna probably put up the other vlog. Hi, hey bud. Hi, you wanna show a trick? Oh, sit pretty, that's so nice. Okay, give me a paw. Oh, that's so nice. Can you sit pretty? Come on, Finn. Hey, Finny. Okay, sit pretty. Come here, up. Come, come on. Okay, give me a paw. Give me something. Oh. You were just jumping all over me a second ago, you little sweet boy. So our bed is so low that I think he thinks that it's a giant dog bed. Because he was trying to get up there or like be sleeping on the bed all night long. There is? How many did you do? 500? 50? Is there, you, you emptied your entire sofa. For one shower? No, I used all three. What? I used all three. You used all three bottles? <laughs> you said you did 500 though. I was joking. You were joking about, about that? I probably did like 50 squirts. 50? Yeah. Which armpits smell fresh as a daisy, don't they? Yeah. Again, show us another one. <laughs> so good. All right, Livy's got a go gurt, some peaches, and a little peanut butter sandwich. And what do we got for Ethan? He has leftovers, rice, and then this is just salsa chicken. So it's just chicken, salsa, corn, and beans in a crock pot over rice. Super easy. And then I'm gonna trying this. I got this at um, Save Mart. It's a local grocery store that just opened. And there are these gourmet, gourmet meals in minutes. This is the Chinese beef and broccoli. And it's 150 calories per serving, three servings per package. And you just put it in your freezer. So this is what I'm making. It's currently uh, cooking and defrosting. So we'll see how that tastes. Well, I've gotten this room sort of cleaned up. It was such a mess. I had a huge box of stuff that was like PR, decluttering stuff, um, which I usually just, I give that stuff to friends and family. But it was just all in a big old box. So I went through and organized it all by like foundation, powders, lips, all that kind of stuff. Cause I did a declutter not too long ago. So I got that all organized, all my cosmetic bags. Um, so it feels good. I have some Amazon return, <laughs> this hat. There was so many bloggers posting about this hat and it's so cute. Um, but this is what I got sent. Like, this is not what I ordered. And I've been trying to get it returned. And so I might just have to call Amazon because the seller's, like, being unreasonable to return it. I'm like, this is literally not what I ordered. I mean, it is what I ordered, but I didn't order it to look like this. Like, this is supposed to be completely flat. This is supposed to be popped up. I mean, look at this. This is... Like, what am I going to do with this? Like, and I've tried to push it out. It's just, it just does not work. Um, For my makeup... So I'm kind of doing what I normally do. I gotta put lashes on because we're filming today for my rhinoplasty video. And I'm gonna move this, but last time we filmed, we kind of just did this angle with like low lighting. Um, <clears throat> so I might have to move a few more things when they get here to set up, but um, I get a lot of questions about where this stuff is from. I usually have it linked in my videos, but this rack is from Amazon, Target, TJ Maxx, um, Home or, uh, World Market. 
think that one was TJ Maxx as well. And then the light is Target. And then a lot of these hats are just Amazon hats, actually. And then the plant is from uh, TJ Maxx. And then I just have a few leopard dresses and stuff all here. But I probably need to fix this one because I'm missing one. And I don't like that's a different color hanger. <laughs> Anyhow, I gotta go get live up because it's a little bit late. We have these frames that I had to put up, but I still, again, haven't put any photos in them. And then I want to redo this. This is feeling too farmhousey country for me and we're kind of going more restoration hardware style so um keep the table I just got to change the decor at some point but again I haven't done it yet oof well I just got one two three videos filmed it would have been more than that but um I'm running out of time Liv is boycotting her nap so I filmed a products that didn't work for me video and a haul video and a favorites video. I was going to film my Sephora fantasy cart. I'm at $725 for that. I am trying to get to a thousand, but I haven't quite made it there. Uh, I feel like I'm like trying to like scrap for things now to, to make it equal a thousand dollars. Probably because I just bought stuff had I not bought all these things about three weeks ago, it'd be a lot easier to have a thousand dollar cart. But um, I thought that was a super fun video. So I wanted to get that filmed, but I might have to do that another day. So anywho, three new videos will be coming up, plus this one, which is a vlog. So that's four. That's pretty good. I even changed my clothes halfway through filming so that it looks like I'm filming on a different day. Those Jedi mind tricks that us YouTubers do. <laughs> so today we're gonna do a Love Every unboxing. I have been buying these Love Every boxes since she was a like, newborn baby. And then recently they just actually asked if they could send us some boxes and I was so excited because we have been buying these for months, like more than months. We've been buying them for years. <laughs> so Lily, let's look in here. So we're gonna open this one, which is the 19, 20 and 21 month, which is the next box that she should be getting. The other one, I think when they, it let me choose the boxes, I accidentally choose the box we already have. This one, look at, this one's the realest box. May I have those? Thank you. So this one tells you everything that's inside the box, which is great. <gasps> this is so cool. It's so we can match. Look at you, match it. Which one goes into each one? That is so cute. You want yeah, you want to come help us unbox it? What do we have here? Oh, this one oh, yeah. is a puzzle. Oh, cool. It's like carrots and onions. I don't know how to do this one. Well, let's see. Let me see. Yeah. This one, I think you want to put some inside. Oh, here's two batteries. You want to put those in there for me? And then the other cool thing about each of these boxes is you get this little, um, you get some coupons, but I you get this little one. packet. And it will tell you how to use each of the toys, which is really fun. Gives you ways to play with them. Very handy. What's in here? Little pouch. What's in there? Oh, this will be fun. Look at it. They stack on top of each other. Can you try? And then we got some little books, few and many. She loves these and these are great for in the car. So you gotta use a penny to open books which are super fun they're great for in the car throw in your diaper bag this one's being silly and then we have leo and melody at the farm cute little story and bedtime for zoe zoe oh i think this is for this look oh that's me and then you can stack them that's fun huh and then we have a cup, what does this one say? Oh, this is to teach them pouring. So you put water in here and then they can pour it back and forth, which is fun. And then what else do we have? Okay, you wanna play with so that this I think is a light. A flashlight. Oh, cool, Libby, look at, look at brother. Look at brother. And then this has a bunch of different locks, which is super fun so that they can open the locks, get the balls out, different latches. So super cute. Thank you, Love Every, for sending me these. 
Um, this literally is so easy. It is. Well, I'll show you what's in this one, oh. even though we already have it. Ooh. All right, so this one is the Pioneer box. It comes, this is one of her favorite toys. It's this little bug catcher. And then you have these little Velcro bugs that stick think, to the is outside. Is that a tree? Looks like a tree. Maybe it's a tree, yeah. Uh, this is really cool. She loves this one too. There's all these different types of beads and then you thread them. So it teaches them the fine motor skills of threading, like putting this little thing through the holes. Um, and that's one of her favorites. She carries this one all the time. And then this one has two little cars and you can race them down the little track. You have a soft ball. Uh, this one has little cards that you can stick in here and then as they get older you can roll it and it will say like touch your toes and a little like Simon Says type game. And I've never saw that. You haven't? No. It's in the playroom. Oh, and then this little box has a little mirror, which I just actually saw this. And then a little mouse. And then um, the books are things I can do and Max and Nana go to the park. So super cute. And again, you get the little booklet that tells you how to interact with them with these toys. So I will have a link down below if you guys are interested in Love Every. When she was a newborn baby, we actually had um, the little play mat and then there was toys in the first few boxes that we could attach so you can switch them out. And she loved it. So I loved it. Like I said, we've been buying this since she was a baby. Yeah. But these ones were thankfully gifted by Love Every. So thank you so much. Bye. Okay, so I'm making like a little scramble here. Um, Ted heated up the little hash browns and these turkey burger sausage patties while I was at the gym. Um, but what I have in here is one full egg. I have um, 45 grams of these egg whites. And then these are what the little turkey sausages look like. Oh, turkey. They're like the Jenny O turkey sausages. And then the hash browns. Are they in here? Probably not. This is getting very difficult. Okay, so I don't know where the turkey burger sausages are. We have to buy more. So I'll show you the turkey burger sausages when I buy more. Um, you just get them where like the turkey burger is and I believe they're like the Jenny O brand, but for two of the patties, so for two of these, it's 70 calories. And then we just use the like Potatoes O'Brien uh, potatoes, and I think it's like 68 grams uh, of potatoes is about what we use. And then that's my scramble, and it's so good. It's so filling. I just do a little bit of salt and pepper. You can do the... Um, everything but the ba bagel from Trader Joe's seasoning if you want. Oh, and then I add just a tiny bit of cheese. So I add 14 grams of cheese. And the way I weigh it is, I'll just take my little scale. You can get this off Amazon. Had a few questions in my last vlog about it. I stick a bowl on it, I turn it on, and then once the bowl is already on there, I turn it on, and then I'll pour until this says 45 grams, and then I'll press this again to clear it, and then I will pour this in until we get to uh, 14 grams and then I just put one egg in there scramble it up and we already obviously you saw we had a lot of this already meal prepped so we have it for the week for breakfasts and then we cook the whole thing of potatoes and then just measure out what we want and then it just makes it easy we just have to cook the eggs so that's going to be my breakfast and I'm also going to get actually let's turn this off because I think that's pretty good and then I'm gonna get a protein shake because I just got back from the gym. And I got these, I don't, I wouldn't buy these again. Um, they have less pro, uh, wait, they said 20 grams of protein. Yeah, they have 10 less grams of protein and they're only 10 calories less, but they're like super sweet. Um, so I don't know, I don't love those as much, but this is the one, these are the ones that I like. The Premier Protein, um, 30 grams of protein, 160 calories, one gram of sugar. And that's what I'm gonna have with my meal. So it's Sunday. I just woke up from a good nap. So I did this little one. And um, I went by the mall. I had to exchange a couple things. Went by Target. Um, can I see your pencil case? We got, oh, wow, okay. We gotta eat them in the pencil case. For school, it's really cool. Got it off Amazon. Just like unzips, it's just a giant zipper. And then the whole thing unzips. 
And then we got some organization thing. I'll link these two different ones. There's these bigger bins here and then smaller bins because I have, um, she is a professional organizer. She's gonna come and help me do our, um, what is it called? Closet. So a couple of the things she wanted me to order just came in. They're from, again, Amazon. I'll link them down below. But we're not doing much today. Oh, it's just been a nice lazy weekend and it's been delightful. Huh, buddy? <laughs> Watching The Incredibles. Okay, so you guys saw how I made my Brussels sprouts in the last video. So this is how I reheat them. I put them on just some tin foil. You can just put it on your pan, spray with a little cooking oil, and then cook it at 375 for five minutes, and it makes them all crispy again. We had In-N-Out Burger for dinner, which I can't remember the last time I've had In-N-Out. And because that's really greasy and heavy, um, I'm eating Brussels sprouts, because I don't know about you, but they're like a natural uh, laxative. <laughs> TMI, probably. Let me know if that happens to you too. I've never ate Brussels sprouts until recently and woo, they are a good cleanse food. Can you with me? Good dog. Okay, which ones do you want to put together? This one? Okay, and then which one do you want me to put on top of it? This one's blue. Which one do you want to go on the blue? Uh, yeah, this on there?